How's it going everybody and welcome back to a brand new video. Today what I've got for you is some Elite 1 Foot Champions rewards and some uh, Div Rival rewards. I was going to say Foot Rival rewards. It gets earlier and earlier every single day. I am absolutely shattered today. Um, but I thought what we'd do, instead of doing two separate videos today, I thought we would put all of the rival rewards from all four different rewards are going to be opening and all of the chance rewards from all four different rewards are going to be opening and put them into one video so we've got my rewards we've got keen rewards we've got mark's rewards and we've got simon's rewards all in one video so i thought instead of doing it in two separate ones do it all, all in one long video let me know down below if you prefer it as one video or as two videos i can change it up and do two videos if you prefer or we can do it as one long video it doesn't really matter to me. So, we're going to start off with my rewards. Now, I believe I've got rank 3 in Division 3, which gives me 250k packs and 225k packs. Actually, really decent, considering I don't play rivals during the week. Um, I get rank 3 solely from... Um, from playing all 30 foot champs games because you get about 12,000 points and that gets you rank three which is pretty decent and we actually finished i think on 22 this weekend uh i actually gifted a win to a follower uh yeah i know <laughs> good samaritan me you warm as yeah <laughs> just a really nice guy um i came up against somebody that i recognize as someone that tweets me all the time and is always in the streams and stuff like that uh so what i decided to do was i well i, de I didn't decide to do anything i just he went one and up, and I was just like, you know what? I'll be honest with you. I prefer gold one rewards. So I just quit straight away after one nil. Uh, he tweeted me after saying thanks for the free win. So, you know, nice guy, Ryan. What can I say? I hope that converts into me getting good rewards today. Maybe. Good, good deed equals good rewards. Who knows? I've never opened up my rival rewards and my champ rewards at the same time either. So that as well could factor in if we get good rewards or bad rewards anyway we've got two player picks of four players now gold one rewards here we go come on first player pick be good please okay diego jota is actually decent i am happy with that card and i say that although it's a card that probably won't fit into my team necessarily very much uh, i think that's actually a pretty solid looking card not gonna lie um so i'm not too i'm not too displeased with that uh i'm gonna go ahead and take him Hopefully the next player pick is going to be decent. Now, in terms of the team of the week, I actually don't really know who the team of the week is. Let me quickly, check, let me quickly grab a footbin. Um, who's in the team of the week? We have got Mbappe and Cavani. And Modric obviously would want either of those three. That would be fantastic. Uh, aside from them, um, I would only really want, out of the rest of the team of the week, maybe Callahan or Muriel. Because... I got in from Gretzka in a 81 plus pack yesterday, and uh, and I just packed uh, I just packed um, a Jota, and I've got uh, Footmas Arias. So you know any of those that I just mentioned would be nice. Come on, EA, please! I knew this would happen. I knew I knew it'd happen. Ooh, I knew that would happen, man. Okay, I'm gonna take uh, Koscielny. I already have an informed version of Goretzka. I mean, I could take Goretzka and then have an 85 rated inform for like Icon SBCs. Ah, I think I should take Goretzka so I have the red version of Goretzka to use in foot champs and stuff like that. And then I've got the 85 inform version for SBCs. I think that's actually a good shout as opposed to having an 84 rated red card that doesn't count as an inform for SBCs. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. And I'm going to have the essentially a duplicate because I do want to do an icon SBC soon. And I think an 85 rated inform would be very useful. So we're going to go ahead and store them. I'm actually happy with that. I'm not going to lie. I'm pretty satisfied with my red cards. I knew that would happen though. I just had a feeling that I would get... Um, a red Goretzka. So, let's start off with the untradeable rival packs, and they are the two front packs. So, hopefully, we can get something good in one of these packs. If we get a walkout, I'll be very happy. EA, hook a brother up. Let's see if we can get ourselves some walkouts today. Um, but, yeah, I'm, I, I, like I said, I'm thinking about doing some Icon SBCs. I don't know if it's worth doing Frank Rijkaard over Roy Keane. I have Roy Keane right now, and I do like him. I'm a big fan. I use him at CDM, and then I use Balak. Pogba at centre mid, then I use uh, Best at Cam and Eusebio and Ronaldinho up top. I'm thinking of selling um, Ronaldinho and having Eusebio and somebody else up top. Uh, I really like Ronaldinho in this game, but he's very, very poor at striker. He doesn't score a lot. He doesn't get involved in the, in the, in the play a lot. Um, he doesn't get any assists either. It's kind of really... 
disappointing, to be honest, having Ronaldinho striker because you have this player that can uh, do amazing dribbles and skill moves, but he's not really good at anything up top. It's just, you know, it's not, it's not amazing. So I'm thinking about uh, getting rid of Ronaldinho. Don't know who to replace him with. Maybe I'll go with Eusebio and Ronaldo up top. I'm not entirely sure. Still thinking about it. Um... Any suggestions would be greatly appreciated in the comments down below. Uh, but we are not looking like we're getting anything good right now. Impacts. We've got two rare player pack now, so 250k packs now. Hopefully we can get a walkout in one of these packs. Come on, EA, please. Here's with something. We've got a walkout. Come on. Let's go. It's not going to be pink. It's an inform. Go on, be Mbappe. Italian. Right back. Is that Cag Cagliardi? Cagliari. I don't even know how to say that guy's name. 85 Cagliari. Not the worst looking card, to be fair. Uh, it's another right back that I don't need because I've got second form Cancelo and I'm, I have got uh, Footmas Arias as well. And they're the two right backs that I ever use if I do. Um, but it's not too shabby to be fair. It's not, it's not horrendous. Um, nothing else really in the pack. I mean, it's a decent looking card. What kind of value does this card hold? Again, it's another 85 rated inform as well. He's only a 35k card, so... But it's another 85 rated inform, so it's not too bad. Uh, again, we'll be great for like an Icon SBC. If I did want to do Frank Rye card, it'd be a lot cheaper now thanks to those two 85 rated informs and whatnot. Uh, another rare players pack now for rival rewards. Cornier, yeah, back to back walkouts, please. Yes, back to back walkouts. Come on. It's going to be another inform. Go on, French. Spanish. Right mid. Callahan. Not bad. Not too bad at all. Don't know how much Callahan sells for. It's like a 70,000 coin card. Shame he's got three star skills. If Callahan had four star skills, that card would look very, very good. Sadly, he's got three star skills, but he's got incredible stamina, I must say. He has got incredible stamina. Not a bad pack at all. His stats look really decent in game as a side. Aside from stuff like curve composure, like if he was just running up and down the wing and crossing it in, he'd be very decent. Sadly, I won't be using this card, but it's an 86 raid inform for again SBCs, so I'm not too I'm not too displeased with that. So we've got two 100k packs now. If we can continue with walkouts, that'd be brilliant, EA, please. It'd be very nice. Nope, no walkout in a tradable pack. Of course, it's going to be an inform though. Who is this one going to be? It's going to be English. It's going to be a striker. Don't know who this is. Uh, Cook. Great. <laughs> I knew him. Yeah, that that lad. Cook. Yeah, him. Great. Thanks, EA. Really appreciate that. A um, couple 84s in there as well. Not too bad. We'll go ahead and uh, discard him and uh, store the rest in the club. We've got one 100k pack left from my rewards. I think he's been pretty successful so far. Can we get a walkout to end it off, please? No, we cannot. Yikes. I mean, I'll take... Oh, we got another uh, inform as well. I'll take what we've had so far. Oh, he's rubbish. Eh, I mean, this is an all right looking card, to be fair. I, you know, I, I was going to make the joke about Modric, but I thought it was just really poor. It's a really nice looking card, actually, to be fair. This rubbish card. He's got really decent stats. Shame he's got three star, three star, because that card would actually be really nice in game with a uh, 84 strength, six foot one, 82 stamina, uh, really nice finishing stats and decent dribbling stats. Um, sadly, I won't be using it. Sells for 15,000 coins though, so I'm going to go ahead and list him up for 15k. I'm going to just take the coins and uh, and, and I'm going to list him up for 14,750. Uh, there we go. And uh, I am going to store the rest and do some 82, uh, sorry, 81 plus packs with those rare players. So, let's go ahead and jump on to some next rewards. I'm pretty happy with mine. I think, I think that's gone pretty successfully. Uh, I'm, you know, I'm, I'm pretty satisfied. We've had some pretty decent cards. Let's do my reward. Let's not do my rewards. Let's do somebody else's rewards. Now we have got Mark division rivals and foot champions rewards let's go ahead and open up these bad boys he got i think rank one in division four because i see two i see two jumbo premium gold packs two rare player packs two mega packs it might be ranked two in division four though it is rank two in division four there you go um but really decent rewards there and of course we have his foot champs rewards which are, is gold three so we have got his gold three foot champs rewards we have got his rank Whatever I just said in Division, whatever I just said, I'm very tired and can't even remember what I ate for dinner last night. I'll be honest with you. Actually, what? No, I, I genuinely can't. Um, anyway, we have got two player picks now. Let's go. Come on. Let's see what we can get. Big yikes. Really big yikes. We got a shot. Okay. <laughs> All right. First one wasn't very good. Second one. 1EA. Be decent. Be decent. Arias. 
Arias is not bad. Arias is not actually too bad. I don't know if uh, if Mark did the Arias SBC, but it's actually a pretty solid card nonetheless, even if he didn't do the uh, Footmas SBC. I'm actually quite interested. Before I open the packs, I know everyone in the comments is going to hate me for this, for, for, for delaying the packs by by 12 seconds, but I just want to quickly uh, just want to quickly check if he actually did the uh, the Arias SBC. Because if not, then that's actually a really nice card to have in the club. Hey, he didn't. That's decent. Okay, nice. So, let's open the packs. No more delaying. Let's open the packs. We've got two Jumbo Premium Gold Packs, aka 15k packs. Let's open up these bad boys first. It's not going to be a walkout in the first one. A lot of people, I get comments all the time asking how I know it's going to be a walkout or not. Down at the bottom, you see where the uh, the little ring is at the bo very bottom of the screen. Um, there's like faint EA Sports writing. And when it's a walkout, there's very, very noticeable EA Sports writing. If you want to quickly go skip back to the video where I opened up those 50k packs and got walkouts, you'll see uh, white glowing writing at the bottom where it says EA Sports FIFA. Um, that's how you can tell it's a walkout. And if you want to know how you can tell it's a board, uh, essentially the, the bottom bit lights up for longer so you see the um it's only like a, um, a second longer it's very uh, until you actually get it down until you get the timing down it's difficult to, to tell there's a transferred uh client there um until it's like you get the timing down you won't really notice but it's um it's it, it just stays glowing at the bottom for a little bit longer so that's how you can tell uh maybe if this is a board i can show you yeah that, as you see like it just it glowed for maybe a split second longer but you can tell once you get used to it so that's how you can tell it's a board and a walkout if you guys still are unsure i'm sure there's videos out there that like that, that show it side by side that you can you can sort of tell anyway um although i've got this with you it doesn't really matter if you can tell or not because i preferred when you couldn't tell um, that is untradeable, sadly. Hang on, let me uh, let me quickly check if he's got a tradable version in his club. Um, no, he does not, sadly. Uh, I prefer when you couldn't tell. I'll be honest with you. I prefer I, I prefer the FIFA 18 glow because I think that, that I prefer that because without knowing it's going to be a walkout or not it has a little bit more supp uh, surprise element and exciting to it. Um, I don't know. May maybe that's just me. Uh, like, hey, you know it's going to be Struman, right? But, like, it could have been Hullet. Huh. No. Okay, maybe not. But you know what I'm trying to say. Anyway, uh, let's move on. <laughs> let's move on. Um, two boards and 35k packs, though. Not too bad. Uh, these are the untradeable ones so far. We have got two more to open. Um, I think these are both now tradable. Yeah, these are both now tradable from, from Foot Champs Rewards. So, there we go. We got a walkout in a tradable one. Come on. What's it going to be? It's going to be a normal walkout, please. Italian. Striker, Immobile, 87 rated Immobile, not too bad, that's decent, that's not bad at all, we'll take that, we will take it, go on, come on, I'm in a good mood, I don't know why, I'll be honest with you, it's like really early, but I'm in a good mood, so, up the lads, I don't, I don't know, is that something people say anymore? I don't really know. Anyway, second 35k pack from Foot Champs Rewards, it's not going to be a walkout, it's going to be a board. It's going to be a board. We'll take it. Be something decent. Be like a high-rated one. Be a walker. Um, Fabinho. No, it's going to be L Lucas Laver. There you go. I was going to say Luis Laver. It's going to be Lucas Laver. Um, we'll take the boards, though. We will take the boards, and we'll, uh, we'll discard the team manager items, and we'll take the walkout from the tradable packs. Now, we've got two rare players packs from uh, Rival Rewards, followed by a, uh, a rare player pack that's tradable from Foot Champs Rewards. Not going to get a walkout in the first one. It's not even going to be a board. Jeez, EA. Come on, that's a 50k pack. That is a 50k pack. That's like a £10 pack. At least we're getting a non-walkout in the untradeable one. So that in the tradable one, if we get a walkout, it means a lot more. Um, second untradeable one from Rival Rewards. Come on, EA. Come on. No walkout again. Disappointing, to be honest. Oh, my word. Two non-board 50k packs in a row. Are you kidding me? Are you joking? 282s in a row. That is disgusting. That is absolutely disgusting. Come on, EA. Give us a walkout now, surely. I'm shocked. I'm disappointed, EA. I'm very disappointed. That that code of conduct. No, that is a code of conduct breach. That right there is a code of conduct breach. That is that is not very nice at all. Not happy with that. 284s is not bad, but not happy with that at all. Not happy with that at all. Disappointing. Anyway, we have got two more sets of rewards to go. So let's go and do them.
Now it's time for King's Rewards. Now we're yet to get a future star in any of these rewards. If we're going to get one, it'd be nice to get one. Uh, I have no idea what rank this is in what division, but he gets four. Okay, he's rank two. I have no idea what division it is, but you get two mega packs, two rare mix players pack, and four jumbo premium gold packs. I don't even know what division that is, I'll be honest with you. And then he has got gold three foot champs rewards, which are always nice to open. So two player picks of three items. Let's go. Come on, EA. It's going to be Suarez. I think that's how you say this guy's name. Suarez in the first one. 93 aggression on the card. It's not actually too bad. But apart from that, pretty average card with pretty average stats, to be honest. Um, nothing too special there with that card. Let's see if we can get anything good in the second one. Come on, EA. Rebic or Kish Ooh, Rebic or Kishelny. See, Rebic has got decent stats, but Kishelny is higher rated. I'm going to have to ask Keen on this one. All right, we're going to go with Kishelny here. Not too bad, to be fair. An 82 and an 84 from Gold 3 is pretty decent. Uh, and then, of course, we have all the packs to open now, which is going to be pretty decent as well. So hopefully we get something good from all of these packs. We're going to start off with the 4 15k packs. Come on, EA. Give us something good. 15k packs never seem to be very good for me. Um, maybe it's just me, but I see a lot of people get decent things every week in their weekly 15k packs. Then there's me, and mine look like that pack right there with like one rare and all the rest non-rares. And like all the rare, rare items always seem to be like manager items and stuff. It never seems to be anything useful or decent for the club. So yeah, yikes from me. But... You never know. You never know. It just takes that one pack to change it all. Just takes that one Ronaldo in a pack to get Ronaldo in a pack. And then, boom, you've got Ronaldo in a pack. You know what I mean? So, let's get Ronaldo in a pack. Come on, EA. Give us Ronaldo in a pack. Come on. Uh, just, you know, we just jinxed it now. We have to get him, surely. No? No? Okay. I'm going to just be quiet then. I'm going to just, I'm going to just, I'm going to just be quiet. We're just going to rush through the 15k packs. Not going to lie. I'm going through them like they're so, like, quick because... I just wanted to get them out of the way. We've actually got a board in one of them, to be fair. Not too bad. It's going to be Navi Cater. Of all the boards, we have to get like the cheapest one in the entire game. <laughs> we'll take it, though. I remember when Liverpool fans were so excited to have Navi Cater in their club and have him in FIFA and stuff, and they gave him like one of the worst cards I've ever seen. Yikes. Anyway, um, we've got two prime mixed players packs now. Why are these rewards? Like, why? why who wants a prime mixed players pack? I'm pretty sure you get bronzes in these. You do. You get bronzes. Who wants two bronzes? Two rare bronzes, should I say? The rest non-rare bronzes. It's just, I mean, whatever. EA, I guess. Yikes. I don't even know what EA are thinking. Sometimes we've got a board in it, though. Actually, to be fair, what's it going to be? It's going to be Croatian goalkeeper. It's going to be Subasic, I think. I've got an itchy head. We've got super sitch in it. It's not too bad. Two rare mega. Let's try that again. Let's try. Let's just. Let's just try that again. Two rare mega packs from the uh, the two remaining div rival packs. I like rare mega packs, so you never know. We could get something good in one of these. Then again, I just said I like them, so EA like to mug me off and give me absolutely nothing in them. Maybe. I, maybe I hate them. I hate them. EA. They're the worst packs in the game. Rare mega packs absolutely suck. They. 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 They're, they're trash. EA. They're, they're awful. Why would. Why would they ever be good? They're the worst packs in the game. Didn't work. Reverse psychology didn't work, sadly. We're going to get a, an inform from it, actually. What's it going to be? It's going to be Spanish, left mid. Don't know who you are. We're just going to skip that. <laughs> I was really hoping for something decent there. But then again, it's a non-walkout inform. So how good can it really be? Oh, my. Oh, dude, that's an awful pack. That, that That is an awful, awful, awful inform, should I say. Not pack. Awful inform. But we got two mega packs and a rare player packs now. Or a rare player pack now. For foot champs rewards, so hopefully we can get something good from one of these. Uh, these are for finishing gold three, and then we have got elite one rewards right after this on Simon's rewards. So hopefully we can get something good in those as well. So let's have a look. Anyway, we've got Ducore in the first 35k pack. Nothing too spectacular there. We we'll go ahead and discard that. Um, second mega pack. Come on, EA. Come on, EA. Give us something good. Come on. No walkout again. Is it going to be a board? It's going to be a board this time. What's it going to be? It's going to be Spanish, Striker, Morata. I was going to say Chelsea. Oh, we, got, we got Chelsea, lads. We got Morata. I'm really tired. I am so tired. It's unreal. Uh, I only got like three or four hours sleep last night. So, it's, you know, it's not good. It's not good. Um, and this is like a 30-minute recording so far. So, I don't know how I'm getting through this. Anyway, we've got a rare players pack now. Come on, EA. Give us something decent, please. 
No walkout in the rare players pack in the 50k pack. It's going to be a board though. What's it going to be to end off uh, Kian's rewards this week? It's going to be another Morata from Chelsea. A big yikes from me. It's nothing too spectacular there. Um, although, to be fair, last week uh, he did pack an icon in his rewards. So, you know, I think this week it's pretty just that he didn't get anything too spectacular. Um, too spectacular is what I'm going to say. Not spoo tech. Anyway, uh, let's go and open Simon's rewards. Time for Simon's rewards now. He has got Division Rivals rank three in Division One, which is decent. Two rare, uh, two yeah, two rare players packs, two mega packs from Div Three rank, uh, Div One rank three. Yeah, that said that right. Uh, and then he has got his foot jumps rewards as well. Um, he had got Elite 1 this weekend. Very, very decent uh, indeed. Very good achievement. Um, so he gets three player pick with five items in it. Two premium team of the week packs and two jumbo rare players packs with 125,000 coins coming his way as well. So, first of the three player picks. What's it going to be? EA, it's going to be Koscielny in the first one. Not too shabby. We'll go ahead and get that. 84 rated. Decent for SBCs if he needs. Apart from that, probably won't make his team. Second one is going to be... Rebic, 82 rated, not too bad. I mean, the stats look decent, but apart from that, you know, it's it's pretty mad. I don't know why I've just rushed through these. I like taking my time with these. I don't know why I just rushed through them. Like, I had to get them done in three seconds or less. And the last one is going to be... Ooh, Callahan. 86 rated is not too bad there. We'll take that. So we've got an 86, an 84, and an 82. I mean, it's not rewarding enough, in my opinion, for... for for uh, Elite 1, but it's all right. I mean, that's his team, by the way, if you guys were wondering. It's a pretty solid team. So, we have got a bunch of packs to open now. We have got the two rare player packs from Rival Awards. We've got the two mega packs from Rival Awards. Let's start off with the two mega packs, and then we've got the two premium team of the week, pack, team of the week packs for Foot Champs Awards. So, first mega pack is going to be a board, actually. What's it going to be? Come on. It's going to be Portuguese Cam. It's going to be... Manuel Fernandez, sadly. Oh, sorry, Bruno Fernandez, even. Not even Manuel Fernandez. I don't know who Manuel Fernandez is. I think he's the Russian League left mid. Um, so, not a great start, sadly, from rival awards. Uh, let's go with the second mega pack now. Come on, EA. Come on, EA. Be something decent. No walkout, sadly, from the second mega pack from rival awards. It's not even going to be a board, sadly. So, we'll go ahead and skip through that real quick. We don't really care about that. Um, we'll store all that in the club and discard that. Okay, so we've got 250k packs now from Rival Rewards. Come on, EA. Give us something decent. Come on. <laughs> no walkout, sadly, in the first 50k pack. It's not even going to be a board. What is wrong with EA today? Why am I getting non-board 50k packs? This is just unacceptable behavior. Unacceptable behavior. All right, second 50k pack now, EA. Come on, please. Give us something decent. Yes, we get a walkout. Be a future star. No future star today. It's going to be an inform, though. What's it going to be? French striker. Oh, imagine. Imagine that was Mbappe. That would have been incredible. That would have been fantastic. We've got Koscielny, though. We'll take that. Not bad. It's an 84 rated inform for late. Whatever SBC you're trying to do. Um, we'll go ahead and store that and, and discard those two because I think I got those two from 35k packs. Now we have got the Elite One Foot Champions rewards. Here we go. We've got two... 100k packs and two premium team of the week packs. So the first 100k pack isn't going to have a board in. It's going to have, a, sorry, isn't going to have a walkout in. It's going to have a board in. It's going to be a, a Italian goalkeeper. Who the, who? Viviano? Didn't even know he transferred. Okay. Well, Viviano is now in that club. Okay. I mean, that's an 83 and 100k pack. That's just not good enough. It's just not good enough, EA. Come on, give me a walkout in this next one. Please. Please, EA, give us a walkout. Come on. Come on, Please. Please. Yes, come on. Be a future star. Yes, future star. Let's go. Come on. It's going to be Uruguayan centre mid Bentecourt. Let's go. Oh, my word. Come on. Let's go. I don't know how much he sells for. Bentecourt or Bentancur. Bentancur? Bentecourt? That's huge. 350,000 coins. Let's go. Come on. Yes. Yes. Willie Allen in the same pack as well. Three dupes. What are the dupes? Mar uh, nothing spectacular in the dupes. That's fantastic, though. His card looks incredible as well. His card looks really, really, really good. So we go ahead and store that in the transfer list and store the rest in the club. That's huge. I'm really happy with that. Okay, now we've got two premium team of the week packs. Come on, EA. Give us something good. Give us something good in one of these. We've got a walkout in the first one. What's it going to be? Please be Mbappe or Cavani or Modric. Please. It's going to be French striker. 
Oh, don't do that to me. Don't do that to me. Don't do that to me, eh? You, you little trolls. You little trolls. Oh, my word. I got so excited for a second. Arias, I don't know who you... Well, I don't even know how to say that name. And uh, Kashelny's not a bad start. We've got one more premium team of the week pack to round off the video. If you've enjoyed, leave a like down below. Subscribe to the channel if you guys aren't around here. Thank you for watching. Let's see if we can get something good. Come on, EA. Come on. No walkout. Okay, you know what? We're just going to forget that that pack even existed. This one is uh, this one's a write-off, lads. This one's a write-off. Sadly, it's not uh, not fantastic. But I appreciate all the support on the channel recently. You guys are dope. Thank you all. And I, uh, I'll leave you guys there. No, I won't. I'll see you lads later.